Hello, pop culture news enthusiasts all over the world. My name is Ebony, snarky black girl, or a baby, and this is Pop Culture News. Thank you so much for tuning into Pop Culture News. Make sure you check out the episodes, like, share, and subscribe, and make sure that you hit the bell for notifications so you never miss an episode. Peace, because I'm baby, young, baby, young baby so i want to first and foremost start out by saying thank you so much for subscribing liking and sharing this video without you all this would not be possible thank you guys so much for but that i want to jump right into the video because y'all know last year i did a whole bunch of celebrity psychic readings please check out the playlist that i've listed up above and go ahead and take a look at the video that i did on rihanna and my prediction for chris brown yada 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 that wasn't all the way accurate because clearly she's not with chris but she is expecting baby number two with ASAP. If you guys watch the reading, I won't go too deep off into it, but if you watch the reading, then you know I predicted that she'd have a girl, but then she had a boy. And so I was like, I still feel a boy, a girl coming out of the cards here somehow, some way. So maybe this baby that she's pregnant with right now will be a girl, but one will not only know until I guess maybe uh, she goes into labor, which will probably be sometime in September. I can only assume. So congratulations to Ree. Ree once again is having her baby, uh, but it looks like her and ASAP has been like super busy. I guess that's a good thing. That's a fabulous thing. Um, so yeah, shout out to those two. What do you guys think? I mean, I guess technically, I guess it doesn't matter what you think about this girl's life, but are you hoping to get an invite to the baby shower? Because I know for a fact that I am, you know, me and Beyonce, we can go pull and put together and get a gift. And also for all my girlies out there, I know this is pop culture news. I'm not going to make this too deep, too whatever, but I do want to let you guys know that if you are suffering from PTSD, burnout, or any other type of like mental health issue that has come about because of stress, uh, acts of violence, I mean, I have to take it there. I know, I know, I know. Or even just like overworking yourself, then meditation is going to bring you answers. This is going to be a little deeper than what I know y'all are ready for, but I'm going to ask it anyway. Who out there has suffered from sexual abuse or sexual violence in their past? Raising your hand. Me, I have. And how have you coped with getting back out there on that baloney pony? <laughs> I mean, how have you handled getting back out there and hopping on that pogo stick and finding intimate love in your life all over again? Because is it just me or is that not like the most emotional, scary moment of all time trying to trust somebody to be kind and gentle with your body after having experienced somebody that probably was not? And I know that moving forward, I want to expand my romantic sector. And one thing that I really, really look forward to doing again is <laughs> practicing these moves. I got them because moves I got like moves. Jagger. I got moves. I got moves and I want to one day experience like authentic sexual pleasure without being ashamed, timid, or afraid to be myself in bed. So my ladies out there, what have you guys done to prepare yourselves for that, um, Swore way, swore, swore way, wait, swore, swore way. How, how did uh, how did uh, Mary J say it? In this dancery, this three, in this three, how how have you guys planned your three? She soiree, doesn't even go soiree, here. Soiree, back into physical love. Let me know. Drop a comment down below because those are the kind of questions that I won't answer. Cause I mean, I'll let you know how I felt about it but it hasn't happened yet but i'll let you know when it do because going forward i do want to finally get back to that place where i'm back in a physical love relationship with somebody that i care about deeply maybe not so deeply <laughs> long as he go deep <laughs> long as he go deep thank you so much for tuning into pop culture news make sure you check out the episodes like share and subscribe and make sure that you hit the bell for notifications so you never miss an episode Peace, cause I'm baby, young baby, young baby nigga.